Many of you may not be aware of Spain's Rio Tinto River. It's a toxic river that can be found in the southwest of Spain. Since around 3000 BC, the land close to the river has been mined for its rich deposits of gold, silver and other precious minerals. The river is known by its unique red and orange colour. It has this because of the chemical makeup that is extremely acidic. The waters are not suitable for humans. The only living organisms that can be found here is bacteria that doesn't require air. Incredibly, this river maintains its colour for around 50 kilometres. The length of the whole river is 62 miles or 100 kilometres. At this point it starts to bend itself with other streams that are connected to the Atlantic Ocean. Interestingly, this river has piqued the interest of scientists as they think it has the same conditions as other worldly rivers. For example, over the last few years there has been much interest in oceans on Europa and Titan. It's thought this could help us to identify which bacteria is able to thrive in such harsh conditions. As the brightest moon in our solar system, Europa is actually entirely covered with ice. According to the researchers, by studying Europa's density it's pretty obvious it has a lot of ice, which means there is a lot of liquid too. Certain models of Europa show there might be oceans as deep as 50 kilometers, under the 5 kilometer crust of ice. This isn't the only body of water that humans can't touch. Another is the mysterious boiling river of the Amazon. This boiling hot river was actually once thought to be a myth. However, one geologist decided to make a trip to the Amazon to find out if it was real. Once he reached the region, he discovered that it was in fact real. The waters of this river can reach up to 200 degrees Fahrenheit. It's surrounded by large stones and guarded by 60 foot walls of forest and vegetation. The locals believe the river was sacred and that the hot waters held healing powers. The nearby shamans incorporated it into their medicines. The river can reach up to 16 feet deep in some places. You also need to be careful of the surrounding mud. This is because it can reach scorching temperatures. Scientists have said that it would cause third degree burns in less than a second. Interestingly, scientists are still unsure how the boiling river came to be. One idea that's being put forward is that a drilling company accidentally ruptured a geothermal system, releasing gases from inside the earth into the river. The river is protected by the local shaman, and if you want to get close to it you must first have their permission. To this day scientists are still studying the river. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.